this last 18 months or so has just been kind of crazy uh, to say the least. What are probably the biggest lessons that you've taken away from the pandemic? So the biggest lesson for us, and it was, we, we were surprised, is that clients don't care about coming in the office. <laughs> so meeting on, as we're meeting here on, on video, a meeting by phone, um, that didn't, I mean, we had a little bit of COVID hangover the first quarter of this year of 2021 mm -hmm. because cars stopped driving last summer. Yeah. Um, but by and large, we have not experienced what a lot of lawyers are reporting, which is, is the inability to settle cases. Mm -hmm. um, uh, you know, some of the big giant cases, yes, insurance companies like 2024 20, trial date, we're not talking to you now. Um, but COVID really didn't affect us um, negatively. We're, we were uh, blessed to be able to, to have the technology to instantly do everything from home or from wherever. But what we didn't expect and were surprised by is that the clients were cool with it. Like, mm -hmm. why? And, and our office is not hard to get. We're not in the middle of a, of a downtown. It's a nice office out in the suburbs of Virginia. Um, but being able to do this and now being able to do you know, court appearances, I argued a case in the Fourth Circuit Court of Appeals just like this, uh, you know, in video, and that was an, an amazing experience. So I think um, I think that's that was the lesson for us. I think that kind of the the interesting, cool challenge now for us is as Ben starts to think about. I mean, on one hand, I think I go live to 110, right? Um, but as you start to think realistically about what you want to do, and, and, I'm, and I'm transferring from lawyer, I'm pretty far along the path to not doing a lot of legal. Again, I supervise a wonderful department. I edit briefs. I, I give strategic decisions, much like your role, I suspect, in your company. Mm -hmm. As we transition to full CEO, that is a different job than entrepreneur. Think about it. Like there's lawyer and there's lawyer entrepreneur, and now there's CEO. And CEO is building and solidifying this business that will generate income for Ben mm -hmm. long after Ben's actually working it. That's a new skill set. That's why we read 70 to 100 books a year, right? To, to learn new stuff. And that's a challenge because your ego, pointing to myself, your ego is so tied up into nobody could do it as good as I could. The, you know, my, it's my name on the firm, the clients actually want me. Um, uh, you know, I, I should be working harder. I should be answering interrogatories and stuff like that. That's, that's been a hard thing for me to, to get, to get beyond. Um, but I have coaches, right. And I have, again, corporate coaches and individual mindset coaches coach, um, who helped me do that. And that's, a for the stage of my life, that's the challenge over the next few years is to, is to learn how to be a really, really good CEO and not feel guilty about um, decreasing the amount of actual legal because we're actually serving more clients and we're serving them better because my team is so good as you've described your team. Yeah. 